hello and a happy Omani Women's Day to you. Thank you. Um, Fatma Hashmi, what do you think are the challenges women face today? Happy Women's Day to you too. Thank you. <laughs> um, actually, this is quite a challenging, uh, difficult question. It's, um, I would answer on behalf of many women. Um, if I would reflect on where I am, I'm quite fortunate to work for a company which value inclusion and uh, gender balance. So in this perspective, um, BP has actually uh, have a strong advocacy on equal opportunity uh, despite gender or color or background. Also have uh, as leading the BP Win Committee uh, for uh, Women International Network in Oman, uh, we launched actually for 2020 our theme as um, uh, equal, um, each for equal mm -hmm. means really equal opportunity for everyone and continue to encourage and um, and uh, reinforce the uh, inclusion culture of the workplace. Just I would like to highlight something, and it's really to empower the women. Um, women at BP are actually recruited based on their talent. They are the best. Um, they are the best candidate for the job. They have been recruited because they can do the job and they can do it better. And uh, for this. I just want to um, pause here and uh, reflect on the um, contribution the BP women have been um, uh, delivering result to the organization and not only having a local impact but overall a global uh, footprint of Omani women uh, which I'm truly proud of and honored to represent the women in BP today. Um, on the same space, uh, on the other hand, in terms of challenges, of course, there are challenges, we can't um, ignore the fact. Um, and this would be the advocacy at home. On this point, um, we have seen in Oman, the role of the women had evolved from purely being a housewife and um, and household uh, activities to actually transforming uh, to education and even um, beyond education, building a career and making an impact in the society, which is necessary for economic uh, development and, and need in, in such need in, the, in this country. Uh, so that would be, um, an area which I would see there is a variation in different households to household. There are still some households, women will feel the challenge is still there to juggle between um, work, um, home, and uh, also um, being a mother. And uh, so in this one, I would just like to reflect my own personal um, experience which I faced in many times uh, people would ask me so how are you doing this how are you actually um, doing an MBA and having six children and having a full-time job how do you do this yes so this is something that many women would ask me about and to, to me um, my advice had always been um, courage commitment and pushing yourself to the limit. Uh, of course, it's also okay for women to, to claim on the help that they receive to achieve their ultimate aspiration or goals. It's okay to, to get help and support. And to me, I would like to recognize my husband. Um, my husband, my family, they have been truly supportive on my journey. Um, my career and overall my um, MBA journey and uh, today I'm proudly to see myself completed the MBA program and um, in one of the top universities in the world so it is really an achievement and if I could do it anyone can do it so you can do it this would be um, really my advice it is uh, about 
pushing yourself forward. It's about building resilience, facing the challenges, and um, living your dreams. Companies like BP and many more are actually hiring talents. So not to pull yourself back when you have uh, gone for a maternity leave or when you're having other uh, family responsibilities and, and then you said, okay, um, I'm busy now, I have to drop the other things on my uh, personal plan. Um, my advice would be, um, it, it would be really about um, uh, you are having the talent, so you still have the talent and the companies and the Oman economy will need your contribution um, that can add value to the overall productive needs. And uh, one point, as the world moving forward in this um, quite a huge shift in the paradigm, more ideas will be needed, more innovation will be needed, and each one of us have a role to play. In the vision 2040 set by His Majesty Sultan Haitham bin Tariq Al Said, it's very clear that there will be a need of many talents and diverse talents, hence the role of women will still uh, be an important part of this economic transformation. So my really um, last advice is keep pushing yourself and growing yourself build the resilience uh, for even more advancements as you move forward. Yeah, that would be it. <laughs> Thank you.